Beavers steps back in. Sun shining down now here on the Bailey Brayton surface. The 2-2 from McMillan. Swing and a miss, strike three. Fastball inside edge. And Beavers goes down, and it's two up and two down here in the first for McMillan. Here comes the 0-2 with one down. The pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three. Change up high and away, and up and down on three pitches goes to Shankle. And here's the 2-2 to Martorella. Swing and a miss, strike three. Off-speed pitch into the turf. Meyer digs it out and throws to first to complete it. And McMillan now has four Ks through two and two-thirds. Yeah, let's keep working down there off the plate with this guy. I don't want to play with fire. It's, he can change things in a hurry. We've seen it the last couple of years. So let's stay off the plate. And the one-two. Swing and a miss, strike three. Five Ks through three for McMillan. And the Cougar bats come up to the dish. Bottom of the third next. Scoreless here in Pullman. You're ahead in a count 3-0. You know, you know a fastball's coming. You're Jack Smith. You're hitting 340 on the year. Maybe he has a green light and just chose to take. Here's the 3-1. This is grounded. Left side of the infield, there's a base hit. Fastball at the knees, and Smith pulls it to left. And the Cougs have back-to-back -back singles. Now, maybe Smith just answered my question with his actions. And the 2-0. Swung on and lifted deep to center field. Back goes Manning to the track. He can't get there. It pounds off the wall. Two runs will score easily. McKee in round second. Ball thrown in. It's a two RBI triple for McKeon as he slides into third. Washington State's seventh hit of the game makes it 2 0 Cougs. This ball was hammered, the 2 0 count, and he was ready for it. So the big right handed power hitter. Uh, we've seen some long home runs uh, this year from him, or the last couple years from him, but uh, this ball was hammered to dead center field. There's only one true Cougs. Right. 2 0 count here with Swartz off the of first. We learned that for sure against BYU and Houston. 2 0 count here, two down the pitch. Swung on and lifted the opposite way. Well hit. Driven to right. Back looking up, and it's gone. Nate Swartz goes opposite way. A line drive homer. And it's 4 0 Cougs. As Swartz takes an inside pitch and drives it over the right field wall. A pretty swing by Nate Swartz. We saw uh, some opposite field power earlier this year, uh, maybe a couple weeks ago. So here's Nathan Manning now, the eight-hole hitter, the center fielder for Cal, who reaches for this one and loops it out into the gap and right. Montez dives and makes the grab. His hat falls off as he supermans towards center. And back-to-back -back series now, Montez has an incredible play in right field. Dead sprint, full dive towards center, right into the webbing, and Montez has the second out of the fifth. Manning's off of first, Liss set from the stretch. The one-two. Breaking ball, strike three. Rings him up at the knees. Soto knew it as soon as it came across. It's a two-two count here. Runner on first. Strike three, outside edge. Fastball. And Martorella's very unhappy with the call. And here's the one-two. Swing and a missed strike three. Smith over the top of a breaking ball. And that's what Grillo has done so well. Now his 28th K of the year. Tough sledding to get uh, over 1,000 people here, but uh, all six previous uh, home Pac-12 games, we've had over 1,000 people. We had 3,600 people for the weekend against Oregon State, uh, a series record. So uh, the Cougs are playing well. He's, you know, Cook fans will, will come out in full force. 2-2, two, two, swung on and missed strike three. Three up and three down here in the eighth. Two Ks for Grillo. We go to the bottom half. Cougs up 4-1. to 0-2 oh, count here, one down, runner on first. And the pitch from Grillo. Strike three, delayed call. 
put him down on a breaking ball and a three-pitch strikeout for Grillo. One-two pitch to Green Jr. Grillo set and deals. Strike three, game over. Washington State beats Cal. On the outside edge, Grillo strikes out the last two here in the ninth. And the Cougs have their fifth pack win and are now one of the hottest teams in the league. They have won four of their last five pack games and they beat Cal in game one of the doubleheader four to one.